going on guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Now today, we are going to be taking a look at five things you did not know you could do in Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Now the five things do virtually revolve around the Vortex, Little Grenades and the Vortex. gun that you can get within multiplayer but before we get into this episode guys do be sure to drop a like down below if this video does reach over 150 likes i will let my sister kick me in the balls i mean you guys are obviously not going to give me 150 likes so we can safely say i am safe on visible from the enemy i tried this a few times online as well and nobody can actually kill you while you do this it's so so essential if you are getting very annoyed by the black hole projectors and the vortex guns, this thing is absolutely lit. I love this thing. It's amazing, guys. It's possibly one of the best things I've ever tried in this game. The turret. I wanted to see if the turret could actually kill somebody using the bull charge, which is essentially your riot shield. Okay, if you didn't know, if you put your payload on the, the bull charge. Here's Johnny. Literally the worst fucking joke of 2016. We have a knife today, a very nice knife, take a look at that, it's a knife. We have a lighter, 1000 degrees lighter, guaranteed, I bought this on the black market. As you can see on the lighter, it actually says BIC, stands for black market. We're going to be heating this knife slash blade up to 1000 degrees today, and then we're going to be cutting some objects. This is insane, this is crazy. Okay, I mean, I guess I better get lighting this blade up. Oh shit, this is getting really warm, boys. Holy shit. Well, okay. Well, you can see that it's at 1,000 degrees right now. This is 1,000 Ah! Holy shit, I literally just shat myself. Wow. Yo, what is going on, JK? And we're playing back on the Xbox One. I don't even have my headset plugged in because I, I completely forgot about that one. <laughs> Click. There we go. Now we might play a little bit better. I've actually gone with a CUDA class right now. I feel like the CUDA should perform a little bit better. I don't know. I just feel like it's a better gun. We've got the haptic camo on it. And I'm actually quite nervous. Dan's actually a very, very good player. Oh, great start. I've got my sensitivity on some mad shit. He has to plant the bomb. He has to plant the bomb. Okay, I can camp this on out. I can see it happening already, guys. I can see this being a 6-0 to Dan. I've not played the Xbox One in legit over, like, a month or so. I'm going to get slapped. Good kill there, though, Dan. Great first kill. I don't want to change my picture to Harambe. It's literally a living meme right now. Fuck. All right, okay. Okay, okay. Let me pick this bomb up and let's see what we can do. This is hella embarrassing because I can't even play the fucking game, all right? That girl is a real crowd, please. Everybody's wrong. Rewrote the song. Thoughts become action. Tell me what's happening. What's your mind wrapped in? Wrapped around. Wrapped, wrapped around. Hey, what is going on guys? It is Hyper bringing you a brand new video here today and what I'm actually going to be bringing you guys in this video is reacting to the mannequin challenge. So guys, if you didn't know, there's actually a massive trend on the internet right now that's like, I don't even know, like there's so many trends in a year, like it's unbelievable how many trends go out throughout a year. And basically, this is the mannequin challenge where you've got to actually stand still. And you, it's not just one person, though. It's like you've got to be like with like more than one person. You've got to stand still for a certain amount of time. Just like. I'm pretty bad at this. Basically, I'm going to be reacting to some of these challenges, which is insane. Like, so I generally couldn't do that. I can't even stand still for a second. I love the song, I don't know why, it's so sick. I don't know how people manage to stay still. Hey, there's Phase K, that's Phase K right there. Phase K. Yeah, I don't know why, they just look so fake. Like, it's it's seriously, when you just look at them, just stand so they look so fake. To me, anyways, I mean, 
let us know if you guys think that. Yo, that is sick though. Like, like how? I would just like fall if I'd done that. Like, I can't even <laughs> bloody. Like, how can you even just like be like. I, I would, if I was to say, I, I wouldn't be able to keep me hand, so. Like, I, Germany, I would bloody, f I would actually fall off the chair if that was me. Like, that would happen. Like, I would just fall off the chair. And then this is the business. <laughs>to be talking about BG Media, the best grime channel in the world. This grime channel is literally the best. And I'm also aware that I'm wearing a camouflage jacket so you guys can't see me, my head is just floating. I thought I'd get that joke out of the way pretty, pretty fast in this video. Most of you guys are still gonna comment something about this jacket. I know. So let's get talking about BG Media. <laughs> BG Media. BG Media. BG Media. BG Media. We got Jack Wilkinson on the cam. Got to get that shout out for Jack Wilkinson there. He's literally notorious around Blackpool for being the best grime filmmaker ever. Shout out to Jack Wilkinson. We've got you covered, boys. We've got you covered. Also, I'm just going to say this real quick as well. No hate to these guys, okay? I don't really want to get stabbed, boys. I don't want to get stabbed up when I go to Blackpool. <laughs> we have this one guy on Blackpool Media called Little T. Little T is about 12 years old, but boys, he can spit some straight fire. This kid is literally better than Eminem and every rapper in this fucking universe. This guy has got some serious talk on his bars, okay? Let's just ignore the noodle head, okay? Because that's the style, isn't it? To have a fucking noodle head. It looks like he's got ramen noodles or a pot noodle on his forehead. Yo, yeah, it's like the bifter. I'm gonna rape your little sister. Five chicken licking. I'm gonna give her a kick in. Oh my god, this this guy's got some bars. I'm gonna rape your little sister. How how many hours, mate, did that take you to actually think of that bar? How many hours was you sat writing on a notepad to produce, I'm going to rape your little sister? I mean, bearing the fact that you're 12 years old, you're probably not going to rape anyone's sister. And also, watching this video, he seems to glitch. It seems like little T is glitching in this video. Like, I'm gonna rape your little sister. Finger licking good. And then he goes to these random bars like, what? This video is just, it's just great. Here's an example of the guy literally just freezing, like, watch. Little T's just glitched out by spitting bars. He doesn't know what he's doing, mate. This, this guy feels awkward, and it looks like he's being forced to spit these bars. Like, I don't know, mate. Little T, what are you doing, mate? I wonder if Little T's mum and dad are sat at home like, Where's little T? <laughs> and then they just walk down to the park and he's there. I'm going to rape your little sister. Little T, what are you doing? Jesus, this BG Media page is absolutely great. Little T isn't the only legend, though, on BG Media. BG Media has a wide, wide range of the top, top grime artists coming out of Blackpool. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about this girl, Sophie Aspin. Okay, Little T and Sophie Aspin's had a little bit of beef, okay? They've been sending for each other. Here, here's a Little T reply from uh, the, the, the person called Sophie Aspin. Let's just take a look at this video real quick. Okay, so she's literally just spawned in to the car park with a tracksuit on with a nice handbag. Uh, typical, is that typical or what? Okay, so she's just spawning in random car parks. I mean, she's probably gonna drop a nuclear or something in this game. Okay, okay, it's all good. Oh, oh, the slow motion boys, yes. I just love how intense it is. She's just walking up to the camera like. Hey guys, it's Scarce here. <laughs> This should be in the ch oh my god, this song is straight fire. Gonna get part with Sophie's bars, Aspen's bars, Sophie bars. See, I could be on BG Media with the flow I have. Oh, guys, it, it, it's just horrendous. Like, the parents must see these videos and just think, what, what, what has happened, Sophie? What has happened? 
I mean, I'm not trying to roast her, but her parents must wonder, what the hell is she doing? Just type in your daughter on YouTube, uh, Sophie Aspin's parents, and this is what she's doing. I mean, she's down at the park spitting bars. Oh, God. It is horrendous, isn't it, guys? This video is just horrendous. Started beef, you fucked it now, but you started beef, you're a Muppet kid, and you send it for me, but this is your job. I think she's smoking weed. She's smoking... Oh, God. Oh, it just gets worse. She's spitting bars with a fucking fat joint in her hand. Oh, I can't, I can't, I can't do it anymore, boys. It, it's just, it's just awkward to watch. Sophie Aspin Duck, what are you doing with your life? The, the bars are just weak. I mean, I could send better than that. Okay, th this is the ending of Sophie Aspin's video. She just. I have to reply to this little prick. All this little prick can go so bit. It's just a, I'm done baby, flicks her hand up in the air and that's the end of the video, she's roasted Little T, Little T's been bodied boys. Guys in fact if this video gets over 150 likes I will send for Little T, Sophie Aspin and all of the legends off of BG Media because I'm sure my bars are a lot better than theirs. Jesus what am I getting myself into? And I'm not joking boys that's the end of the video right there, it's just a flick of the hand and the, the video's done just like that. So far, we've we've had a look at Little T, Sophie Aspin, but I've left the best for the last, okay? Afghan Dan. <laughs> Callum's Corner has literally had a lot of beef going on with this geezer, Afghan Dan. I think he's hooking up with Stormzy to actually roast Afghan Dan, which is pretty cool. But today, I thought we'd take a look at Afghan Dan and Little T's deleted video from BG Media, an absolute classic. I must say Afghan Dan's probably the best rapper or grime artist on BG Media, so yeah, he's, he's actually not too bad. So here it is, the legend, Little T and Afghan Dan spitting bars together. BG Media. BG Media. BG Media. We got Jack Wilkinson on. BG Media. Oh, you got to get that nice old intro in there. BG Media. Sapnin, Afghan Dan, Little T. Oh, Afghan Dan, mate. What? Why are you rubbing your hands all over the guy? Like, he's only 10 or something. Leave him alone. Okay, let's carry on watching this video. I am a top your kid, and I do grind, doing it to pass on time. If you hate me, yeah, that's just fine. Why does little T seem like he's glitching, or like, I don't know, about to explode? Like? Before this video actually starts, I'm just letting you guys know I'm actually doing a giveaway on my channel. All you need to do is like this video, subscribe if you're new, and comment in the comment section below what gift card you would actually like to win out of an Xbox gift card, a Steam gift card, or a PlayStation gift card. And I will pick a winner in four weeks' time. That's all you need to do. Previously.
unaware. There's actually a camo glitch within Infinite Warfare. So if you guys didn't know, the Black Sky camo is pretty. It's not the best camo in the game at the minute. And basically this glitch is really, really awesome to be honest because this glitch is making the Black Sky camo look amazing. Right, obviously I'll show you guys what the Black Sky camo looks like right now and I will show you what it actually looks like within this glitch. And obviously you guys are probably thinking this kind of glitch is probably just Photoshop. You think this image is probably just Photoshop. That's what I generally thought when I first seen a video on it. When I seen one of my friends called right away, make sure you go and check them out in the description below. He actually showed the camo glitch and I I was thinking this looks Photoshop this definitely looks Photoshop just because it was just an image images can be like it literally it's not very hard to Photoshop these kind of stuff and basically it's actually a gameplay of this which I don't think has been edited or anything like this I actually got a de-atomizer like which is a nuke basically within infinite warfare I'll obviously show you guys, so obviously you can see here the the atomizer has gone off, obviously you can see it's going all fuzzy, and then when he gets to run about the door bit, basically right now, it, the camo actually changes, which is pretty insane, it might actually be a glitch, like where the camo's just changing colour, or it might actually be like a new, it might be a feature within the game when you get a nuke, somehow your camo actually changes, uh, like a secret kind of glitch, I, I'm not too sure, but the, like the camo's pretty insane, as you can see, it's totally broken. Uh, obviously, I don't think this has been edited in any sort of software. Obviously, I've told you guys the guy who actually made it. I uh, actually put it on Reddit. Within Reddit, you're not really allowed to put like fake kind of stuff in. Just kind of unusual how the camos actually changed. Obviously, within the camo itself, like the Black Sky camo. As I just want to say, this is a brand new series that I'm going to be bringing on my channel. It's called Super Shout Out Sunday, where there's actually six shouting you guys out. So you have to go and subscribe to their channels and put notifications on for their channel. And basically what will happen is you guys are going to gain more subscribers from that Not just from me, you're going to be gaining more subscribers from the other people who are shouting you out also And basically there's going to be 5 winners each week, which is pretty crazy So make sure you do go and subscribe to the hosts guys in the description below And make sure you go and subscribe to the winners That's all you need to do and comment in the comment section below why you want to shout out Make sure you go and say hybrid sent me to the winner Shout out guys, it's someone called Ice Monk And basically I... I've known this guy for a while now. He's been supporting my channel for a crazy amount of time. I definitely think he deserves it. And obviously, he did start a new channel. Pretty sure he did start a new channel a couple of months back. And basically, he's got 67 subscribers. And I would really like to see him gain at least more than 100 subscribers. And honestly, this guy deserves way more like than he's actually got. Just because he puts in loads of effort. And I remember he's been he's actually been grinding there for a while now. So make sure you go and subscribe to him, guys. It would be much appreciated. So next shout out we're going to be doing guys is coming from its window make sure you go over to windows channel make sure you subscribe to him guys he's only on 18 subscribers and it would be awesome if you go and subscribe to his channel so the next channel we are going to be shouting out guys is someone called it's lucas